Hello, and Barry again with song number 19. And what a great song. This is uh, George Ezra called Budapest. And uh, we're going to look, number one, at the chords, number two, at the structure, and number three, uh, we're going to play along to see uh, how, if we can learn another little cool song from this era, meaning closer to the 20, 2020s. Uh, remember, I always use these songs. This song is written in an actual F. I always use these songs and I and I simplify them for myself so that I'm able to sing them. And then how do I simplify them for you? I uh, find uh, the most basic uh, chord structures and I break up the bar line so you know when to change to the next chord. I also link the chords above the lyric where that uh, chord is supposed to change and I highlight my choruses in, in, in bold print so that it's easy for you to distinguish between the verse and the choruses and so we're going to go straight into this uh, the song is in a 4-4 and as you can see at the song structure if we look at the song structure uh, we look at how well the first part of the song is very extremely basic and easy easy uh, two bars of G actually four bars of G in the end uh, then we've got C for two bars and then uh, G again uh, at the end, I leave it all. Uh, and then, um, yeah, that's about it. Let's get straight into it. Uh, the song sounds pretty cool by just a strum in the beginning. So, my house in Budapest, my golden treasure chest, golden grand piano, beautiful Castile. For you, you, for, I'd leave it all. And then it goes over to the chorus and then it picks up and it builds up nicely. So let's go that again. We're going to go one, two, three on the G4. And my house in Budapest, my, my golden treasure chest. Golden grand piano, still the G. My beautiful Castillo for you on the sea. You, I'd leave it all on the G. Two and three and four to the G. Give me one more reason to the sea why I should never make a change. Two, three, four, still G. And relax. Okay, let's quickly have a look at those chords. G, just a nice easy G. And then we've set the C chord that follows in that verse and then back to G. So G, C, G, C, G, C. Now take time to find that G and C and jump between them or find them. If you do it 10 times, very good. Well, good. If you do 20 to 30 times, that's better. If you do it 50 times to 100, that means you're probably one of the better students out there. Uh, take the time, pause the video, and jump between those chords so that it's easier for you to play along. So we're going to go straight again to that verse, uh, and I'm going to count us in through the chords. And so one, two, three on the G. G, my house in Budapest. My hidden treasure chest, G, golden grand piano, G, my beautiful Castillo for you, C, and you, and back to the G, and two, three, and four, and one, two, now with the D, G again. My house in Budapest, my hidden treasure chest, G, golden grand piano, still G, my beautiful Castile for you, C, you, back to the G, that G's play two bars, excuse my uh, G again. Two, now going to the chorus, find the G, D. Give me one more reason to the C why I could never make a change to the G. We're going to play that part again. And the G, two, back to the D. Give me one more reason. 
to the top we're gonna to start at the top go through my house in Budapest my hidden treasure chest golden grand piano my beautiful custody for you you all the sea I'd leave it all to the G three four and G let's go eighth note top and I'm sing along and one two three four and my house in Budapest my I hidden treasure chest hold it on the G golden grand piano my beautiful custody for you, you. I'd leave it all that's back to the G the D coming up. Give me one more reason to the C should never make a change to the G. Yeah, yeah. Back to the D and baby, if you hold me, then all of this will go away. Four and one all together now with a bit more. My house in Budapest, my, my hidden treasure chest, golden grand piano, my beautiful Castillo for you. I leave it all. The chorus coming up to the D. Give me one more reason to the C, well, I should never make. Chain on the G D baby if you hold me to the sea then all of this will go away I'm gonna do it once more are you ready I'm gonna play along with us let's keep the screen nice and big and relax Okay, take time, pause the video, please find the places where you get stuck and just repeat and play it over. This is going to be our last little play around. Have fun with this and we're going to kind of do it two times around. First, I'm just going to strum on the first verse and then 16th and then we're going to go uh, eighth note. So verse one, quarter note, chorus, eighth notes, and then we're going to play 16th around and end with the chorus two times around. Let's go. So one, two, three. For just one, my house in Budapest, my hidden treasure chest, golden grand piano, my beautiful custody for you, you. I leave it all. Now the D. G to the D. Baby, if you hold me, then all of this will go to the G. We're going to pick it up now. Two and three and a four and a my house in Budapest. My hidden treasure chest. My golden grand piano. My beautiful Castillo for you. To the G O To the D Give me one more reason why I should never make a change D baby if you hold me then all of this will go away 
You're gonna do that chorus once more, just quiet. Give me one more reason why I should never make a change. And on that D, young baby, if you hold me now to see you, all of this will go away. Repeat the last line to the D. And so, baby, if you hold me, then all of this will go away. Yay, what a great song! Song number 19, George Ezra. Budapest and what an amazing song to play along the fire outside on the beach wherever you go have fun with this one this is an easy basic easy one song number 19 George Ezra Budapest hope you guys have fun with this 